A lot of people complain that the crash beam only uses three bolts, so they wonder why it is built this way. This is the rear crash beam on the new Jetta, and the bracket on top supports the rear bumper. The wire harness behind it needs to follow that bracket and move toward the left side. The newer Jetta in the mid and high trims includes lane change assist, and this harness connects to the millimeter wave radar on the left. The bolts on the crash beam only take force in the forward and backward direction. They just need to hold the beam in place. Even with three bolts, the performance does not drop. So instead of worrying about the bolt count, it makes more sense to look at the material. The Jetta Crash Beam uses hot-formed steel with a yield strength of 1,200 megapascals. It has strength close to aluminum alloy while keeping the toughness of steel. Now here is a paid aftermarket Crash Beam. It also uses three bolts, but you can bend it with your hands without trying. Do you know which car this weak one belongs to?